Roger, thanks for dropping by. I thought I'd just quickly walk round um, my bonsai because not everybody's seen all of them. It's a brand new channel. Um, this is what I've got. Um, I will be adding to them in several different ways coming soon. This is my large Scots pine, which there is a video for the repot that I've just done. That's why it's here in the shade at the moment. <laughs> it's not going in the full sun until some roots get going. This is my Acer Palmatum de Shoujo. Um, this is probably my best tree as bonsai go. Um, it's, it's got its spring colour at the moment. And every day I come out here for a coffee, I'm going around looking for things like this and taking them off. <laughs> so every time it tries, tries to shoot out, I'm pinching the shoots out, try and keep it tight this year. Um, I've got a rough shape for it now, I'm quite happy with that. I now need as many little shoots as possible. So that's that one. Then over here we've got my, this is a native beech, English beech. It's getting some nice colour on its uh, trunk now. I was going to repot that this year, but I've decided not to. Um, I cut the top last year to see what it would do. Um, this will become the new leader, I suspect, and this will be removed um, or pushed out sideways as a side shoot. It's just dropping its leaves with a bit of help, and once it gets to the stage that the leaves easily fall off like that, all in my bird bath, <laughs> the chances are the buds are going to open any day now. Uh, once the leaves lose their grip like this and easily fall, normally means the buds are going to open. So we should get some, and quite honestly, it's the best green there is beach when it opens. This is my little one that there's a video on this. I bought this as a nursery bush <laughs> not that long ago. This is a new acquisition and turned it into this bonsai. There's a video for that on the channel. The job now is to make sure that these don't extend. So as these start to extend, they'll get pinched and pushed back. And then this is my twin trunk Zelkova Serrata. Again, you've got a video for the repot on that recently. And then over here we've got my two maples. Um, I actually got these from scratch. So these were actually six inch twigs in a pot when I originally got them. Um, so I've grown these on from there. I'm going around doing the same here every time I see something trying to shoot out I take it off <laughs> as I say just keeping it keeping it tight for this year same on both of those and then the last one over here is my hornbeam um, I've loaded an old video on that so uh, so there we go those are my bonsai they're not all in their final positions um, as I said some repots have been put in the shade immediately and um, you know, some are kept, they do get a bit of morning sun, but they don't get too much of it. So there we go, those are they, and there's more to come.